This gospel will confirm a man when you stand on like God give it to you. Right. When you ain't compromising, selling lollipop and fish dinner and telling lie molesting kids, you'll draw somebody. That's right. I seen old waterhead preacher. He go by the on TV every morning, seeing in. I woke up, I seen him. You know he going bald in the talk. So he was laying back in the chair like this, about to fall over and tear the wall out. <laughs> like a little mirror. Oh, you know what I kept trying to figure out? I said, who sat that minute up on them pillow trying to make it look like he the same height as everybody else? Sitting up there with all that black tar laid up in his head with this retarded right. self. Amen. Whole nation going away backwards. Amen. Something wrong with a man or woman, you start trying to alter what God gave you. Amen. That's a blessing to get a hoary head. That's a white head. Right. Sitting in the barber shop the other day, man, something that painted his head, putting all that tar in his head. That's right. Like a monkey fool. Amen. Hitting that right. I ain't going to put that junk in my head when God make it great. Thank God for Jesus. Amen. Hitting that right. Amen. It's good in God's sight of the sight of the Lord. It's good with me. Amen. Hitting that right. Amen. It's not a shame to get old. Amen. It's a blessing. That's right. Hitting that right. Amen. Thank God for my youth, but I thank God for the days he gave me that he aged in me. That's right. Oh, there he comes some wisdom. That's right. Apparently he's still getting dumb. Amen. Hitting that right. That's right. He know who he is. Sitting down and locked on you. And a dawn telling lies. That's right. Amen. Isn't that right? Couldn't go do your Easter egg hunting because God cutting your money short. That's right. I'm going to keep telling. Let me tell y'all something before you get started. Keep it real for y'all. Once again, if you're not a lover of the truth, it'd be the word 27 minutes, 54 seconds of your life. I'm cutting out everything not like God. I'm trying to expose this system that got the American people hoodwinked. Stop being stupid, folks. Quit worried about Britney Spears and who she's sleeping with. Quit worried about Madonna sitting over in Malaysia trying to adopt some black kids. Look here, woman, there's plenty of black kids in America need adopters. Won't you run by Cabot Town to get some of your own? That's right. We're way to Africa to do no adult. These folks adopting folks. They ain't on the news. That's right. I want to know what's the fascination. All of a sudden, all these Caucasians want to go pick up all these black kids. I want to know what's going on. That's right. I'm just being honest. Well, I want to know what's the big fascination. Why everybody got to run to Africa to go get somebody? That's right. We don't have enough problem in Africa. Stay you behind here and clean up what you got here. That's right. Isn't that right? Yeah. Ain't get high. Anybody going to say nothing about it? You know why the average of these preachers want to address it? Because most of them, they know politics got them tied up. That's right. You look at these sorry, no good, rotten preachers you got. You know you ain't got nobody on the wall crying out against sin for you. Man, that's right. You're sitting down there, your house in foreclosure, your car being repossessed, and your credit card calling you out your name. That's right. Quit being a fool, folks. Amen. Y'all thank God for a clean man. Stand it on the wall. Yes, sir. Tell America what's our problem. Amen. America is sin sick. That's right. Isn't that right? Amen. God done gave him a dial to the Lord. You wouldn't hear God. Now he let that pig blow in your face and give you pneumonia. Amen. No, he's sick. Everybody want to run around want to talk about what God said, the only thing going to stand. Right. You can't be God given. Right. When God blesses you, bless. When He curses you, you are cursed. Amen. That's right. First Thessalonians chapter 4, verse 1. Amen. Listen to the book. Furthermore, then, Furthermore, then we beseech you, yes. brethren, Listen. and exhort you by the Lord Jesus, Come on. that as ye have received of us, yeah. how ye ought to walk, that you might. and to please God. whole lot of people, these folks not being taught how to please God. Right. They learn how to join a church and find out what their pastor's favorite color, what's their favorite dish, what kind of suits he like to wear, and don't know nothing about the Creator. Amen. The man that Creator, they have no information about him, therefore, you are on your way to hell, ma'am and sir. Right. Nobody's correcting your rotten behavior, folks. Amen. Average these preachers sitting on TV and telling lies in sex scandals. That's right. Child molesters and adulterers. Right. Homosexuals. That's right. Hitting that right. right. They ain't got some ignorant woman sitting up calling herself a bishop. A bishop. That's a bull dagger spirit. Right. Amen. Woman ain't got no business trying to be no man. That's right. Hitting that right. right. Amen. They need somebody standing on the wall. That's right. Hitting that right. Amen. That don't impress me. She told me she can urinate standing up. You still not a man. That's right. Amen. Hitting that right. That's right. All right. Y'all all right? Amen. Somebody got to say something about it. That's right. Amen. America in bad shape. That's right. Hitting that right? We sitting in this kid. We, we, we sitting our, ski, our kids, skiers, whatever you want to call them, kids. <laughs> sitting your goats because some of them hard headed. <laughs> sitting them to a school system to try to get them educated and the teacher having sex with them. That's right. We bring them to church. We entrusting the preacher to love them and treat them right. He got them back there in some little class. He having sex with them. That's right. Then a whole lot of them not saved because granddad and grandmama having sex with them. That's right. Mom and dad are doing target practice with the kid. The world is love is going cold. That's right. Why is your standard at America? Amen. 
The reason why we're in the problem we're in, because we will not revert back to what we need to, to the book. When all else fail, read instruction. I know the people sitting here watching me today, and a couple on watching TV are, are smart people. Everybody not ignorant. If you buy a product or you buy a, a, a piece of electronic or whatever, you can go and snatch it out the box and put it together. But when you find some extra pieces and find out there's something you can't figure out how it go, what do you do? Just go back to the instruction. Look at what you got going on. Your economy messed up. Your president is a joke. They put the man in there just to make a fool out of you. When they get him out of here to be just like the city of Atlanta, Shirley Franklin, I know you ain't messed up all that money in Atlanta. Let me tell you something. The people that were in there before you messed it up, and now you got in there, whatever little bitch you put in your pocket ain't going to hurt nothing at this point. They already were going down. Right. When they get you out of there and they put another Caucasian back in there, they'll love them to death. And they'll do the same thing this country been having going on. Man. They ain't racist. That's just reality. That's right. When you sit and tell these folks the truth, nobody want to stand up and admit it. Barack Obama ain't even been in the presidency for a hundred days. Whatever policy he wrote had he went in a fact check. Don't try to sit here and tell this man to wreck this country. Amen. Go look at your sorry movie W. I can't watch this a horror film for me. That's right. I'd rather go watch Jason fight L uh, Alien or somebody. I ain't gonna watch that mess. <laughs> Too close. He just gotta scare me. That's right. I look at that movie. I'll be sitting there saying, "Were we that stupid? That's right. Were we that dumb?" Yep. Amen. Let me tell you, they give you an illusion about a Republican, a Democrat, an Independent, a Libertarian Party, and a Green Party. All these people are the same people. That's right. That's right. Let me tell you something. All this stuff they're going there, they're going to try to go and tell you about this water boarding and all this garbage and how they've been using torture. They've been using torture ever since they've been fighting. That's, That's right. right. Now, let me see. Torture is when you take a man, lay him upside down, and pour water in his face. I wonder what you call that when you take a bullet and shoot somebody. That's right. Pressure? That's with right. your stupid self. Amen. They always trying to give you an illusion or something, make you think they're trying to clean up something. All these people in the same party. Amen. Let me tell you something. First of all, Bush not going to be prosecuted for nothing he done, because we do a whole bunch of Democrats got to go down too. But they got to give you the illusion like they're trying to clean up something. They go get some passive like they always do, just like they did Oswald. Tell you this one man, a long gunner, shot three times out of a window between some trees and popped the president with one bullet that hit him, went through the passenger seat, right. hit that man, jumped out of his rear, turned around, went back, and the bullet didn't even have a dent in it. Yeah. They always got to lose because they know people love lies. That's right. Let me tell you something. The tell lie vision is the biggest problem we got. That's when right. people watch me, that's why it's hard. To, they can't, you know, they sit back and they do. Lies, Somebody yeah. sit there eating it and drop the phone down. That man said what I thought he said. You better believe it. That's right. Because you know what? These people don't control me. That's right. you got to be a free thinker if you're going to serve God. Amen. There's no way you're going to find in the Bible where you ever see the apostles or the Lord Jesus or the prophet ever went along with the system. Amen. They were against the system when the system did not work in the favor of God. Amen. Now you find these rotten, no good, lying preachers. Everyone will come and dust these rotten, so-called politicians. That's right. That little bald head midget I seen this morning, now he loved Barack. He just been telling us a little while ago, Bush is God's man. I prayed for Saddam Hussein to fall, and God answered my prayer. I'm praying that God lock up every false prophet, that he take everyone and tie you up that don't repent and throw you right in the hell.